control of armies from the five kingdoms of Arakania and vie for the throne of the ancient king in Wrath of Kings. Master your skills on the battlefield over on BeastOfWar.com. High Octane Anime Action is the name of the game in Relic Knights. Mount up in your mecha and battle for glory at our Relic Knights hub on BeastOfWar.com. Hey guys, it's Az here with Beasts of War, and you're joining myself again with Alex and Jamie as we're going to continue our Dark Souls campaign. We've stepped it up a gear. Yeah. So we're carrying on the same characters I'm still playing as the Knight. We're going to, hopefully, if you guys are wanting to learn to play, you can check out the previous video. We'll put the link below for you so you can get that, and you can have a little look at how to get a feel. We're going to dive in now, not worry so much about how to play. We're just going to delve into it because we've got a big challenge. Yes. yes. Yeah. <laughs> who, tell me a little bit about who this is. So this is the Dancer of the Boreal Valley. We'll just call her the Dancer for now. Oh. Um, she is quite different to a lot of the other bosses in that she's not defensively that strong, but she puts out so much damage. It's basically her fight is like a race. It's like, <laughs> okay. who can, can we get her dead before she gets us dead? And it's usually a bit of a sprint. And she's a full-fledged boss. She's a main yeah. boss. So we do have mega bosses which will be available, but she is a main boss. Uh, so we've had many, we have main, and there's going to be mega. There's going to be Correct, mega. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's just get into it, I think, guys. We have two level two encounters. So two level twos, two level threes. Okay. Oh. Which will be fine. <laughs> sure. Hopefully run into some old friends. Right, yeah. so, as before, we can leave the bonfire tile, we can go here or here. There yep. are two level twos. Okay, and how many sparks do we have? We have three, so okay. that fully awesome. resets to what we were at because we got yeah. the mini boss. And we got three souls from killing the uh, mini boss because we had a spark left. And you okay. get one cool. soul per spark remaining when and you we kill have the boss. It's treasure as well. Ah. So we have the gargoyle treasure, yep. which comes in here into our inventory. Okay. And I've added five more cards for each of us. So 15 more cards have gone into the deck, which wow. are transposed treasures, and as sort of well as some legendary treasures. Oh, wow, okay. So, so I, know, I know what I want, I want fat loot. <laughs> yeah, all about the loot. So, I believe looking at these, so I can actually equip this <gasps> if I want it. Like okay. just immediately, but I'm quite happy with my yeah, spike mace at the sure. moment. I think I, okay, I'll pop it in there. Yeah, I'll pop it. that in my Absolutely. offhand, just because I can. I'm going to continue then, with my Morning Star and Shield, just yeah, as, in terms as a base. Of our current stuff. Do we want to do anything with these three souls before we go into a room? Nah, I'm ready to roll. You ready to roll go? If you let's guys go. Are. So, this room? Yep. Yeah, let's get clear. Do you like to tank? Yes, most definitely. Okay. I know you, you are pretty tanky, but... You are um, the, the, yeah. the, the tank. tank. The tank. <laughs> okay. All right, so we have... Oh, dear. <laughs> That's not... What ideal. have we got? We have two of these big boy hollows. Okay. So, so just I'll pass, I'll you, yeah, I'll let, I'll let you sort out the board there. I'll grab. So what are these called? These are large hollow soldiers. Oh, the only one I didn't pick up. There we go. Let's have a quick nosy. So and we also have a chest and a barrel. That's these guys. So five health, no magic resistance, only one armor. So at least they're not going to be too hard to hurt. We just have to work through them. Yeah. Yep. Um, two of them. Two. So in terms of our placement. We're kind of relatively safe. They only move yeah. forward one. They don't have any range on them. So okay. where would you like to go? Yeah, just right in the middle. I Front think that's absolutely fine. Yeah. Yep. I'm going to pop myself over here. And I've got my magic arrow. So go over here. I'm going to go and hide yeah. in the corner. Yep, I don't need that. Uh, and the aggro the will go onto here. So in terms of their activation, they'll okay. activate at the same time. We choose which order, and they're yep. both going to go. One's going to go there. One's going to go there. Right. right. So their activation done. Pretty I'm sure going probably. first because you killed the guy. You got the last hit on the. If you didn't catch that, go catch the end of that video. <laughs> and I am going to try and absolutely annihilate one of these guys. Okay. I'm going to move in for free, mm -hmm. uh, and then I'm going to pay three stamina. Okay. Wow. To go for my big hit. My big hit is going to be two blue, one black. I'm at plus one, so I'm straight dice on this. Okay. They have no armor because I've got my Titanite, which gives me my plus one. Oh my goodness. And I one shot him. Six <laughs> damage, one gone. <laughs> so your, your Titanite charge basically adding an, an instant damage, so that's just negating the armor. Everything yep. you rolled on dice was damage. He has five health, you do six, gone. Yep. Awesome. So Feeling strong after that last little so yep. scenario. This will pass over to me. Okay. He will come in. He does, does five damage to me as he moves in. Right. So he pushes me. That push has five damage attached to it. So I'm going to try and block that. I have three ah, black guys. So these guys don't even have an attack on their card. They simply just move and essentially they're so strong they're just going to yep, push oh, you around. Fantastic. 
damage um, that way. So five damage coming in, and I take two. Okay. And it is over to Jamie for Jamie's activation. All right. So I want to try and anything you can do, I can do just as well. I'm going to swap in my soul arrow. Okay. I'm going to go because this one goes there. so well. Spend one, spend two. Yep. Okay. So two stamina to get there. Uh, I'm going to make my heavy attack with my soul arrow. Okay. So that will be three black dice. Four they stamina. have this is also straight dice because okay. they have no resist. Yep. So because, because uh, it's a magical dice. attack, they have no resist. Oh, and sorry, the orange dice. So this will be minus two minus because two. of the hornet ring. And that's it. And it's because we've already gone through these characters through one mission, upgraded yep. them up a little bit, so we've got a bunch of different effects adding up. Yep. So minus two, so that's two damage. Okay. And then I'm going to make my heavy attack with my Murakumo. So this is the advantage the of dual wielding. But this is going to be at minus three okay. because they do have one physical right. block. Mm -hmm. And at minus three, that's another one. So anything I can do, you can do worse. Oh, so we've got one health left. Oh dear. Oh my. I didn't do it. I have to Estus. Is that it? Was that dice minus three? Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So unless Jane, I want to look, <laughs> if you could, yeah, you could. I, look I, I, I'd, I'd rather spend my luck than have to spend my. In Estus. the first room, Jimmy. The first yeah, in room. In the first room. So um, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna reroll one of these. Okay. No. So I have to spend my Estus then. So his Estus oh. is gone because he wow. overextended again. <laughs> Sorry. Your Estus and your luck gone in the first room, Jimmy. You yeah. are killing me. After I've oh, killing shot me. one of them. No, he's <laughs> killing him. Yeah. So, so this guy will go. He will push Jamie off and yeah. Jamie can go wherever he would like to go. And then he is going to move in on Jamie. Okay. And at that point, I'm assuming Jamie's going to opt for a dodge. So he Try pays his it. stamina. Smash barrel. Smashes the barrel. <laughs> this is a plan. How many dodge dice? Uh, just three. Please. And it's a dodge value of one, so you just need one success. Nailed it. Nailed it. Uh, take no damage. No damage. And nice. It is over to you, as. Yeah, I mean, I'm just gonna straight and simple. As a knight, we don't fancy things about. <laughs> no. um, I will just move straight in. I didn't have to spend a stamina, did I? No, no. 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 Straight in. Perfect. Um, so, donk on what am I rolling? So, I've got my. Morning Star, which will give me three stamina, which I think I'll use. And then you get two blue dice. Two and blue you dice. need to roll a total of two and he's dead. Um, he's only got one health left? He's got one health okay, left. Okay, awesome. Mm -hmm. So we just get one armor, one health. And he's dead. Awesome. He dies. Super dead. Uh, yeah, we get the there. chest, which is two treasure flips. <laughs> that will be a reinforced club. So that's mm. very similar to your Morning Star. Yeah. don't think that really functions as an upgrade for any of us. Mm -hmm. And the second one will be an elk horn round shield. So it's got some block, it's got some dodge, it can be used, it's a special shield, it can be used if you have a two-handed weapon. Oh. So it's like a oh, buckler. Oh, okay. Um, it requires 16 strength, 34 dexterity, and 16 intelligence. So it's quite a way off for me. Yeah. It, uh, whose transposed item is it? This is uh, one from the assassin's transposed deck. Ah, so it is okay. an assassin shield. Okay. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not going to be anywhere near using that. So What's its special rule? Is it just that? Is that the two-handed thing? Yes. Oh, we so, need to get you a good two-handed weapon. Is that what we're saying, Jimmy? Not yet. <laughs> not yet. So we get six souls for yep. completing the Lovely. room. Lovely. So we have nine souls now. Yep. We're sitting on nine. Um, do we want to spend them for anything? We get yeah, to so clear our endurance. Uh, I'd bars. like to spend the odd one to get my luck back. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So we'll spend yep. one of them gone. Jamie has his luck back. I definitely want a new something. <laughs> you want to use something, so we'll go for one oh, treasure. Uh, maybe uh, I've got a Morning Star has a mo an upgrade slot, and my armor has two upgrade slots, so something in one of those would be lovely. Okay. See what we so get. we've got some Deacon robes, which I don't think are functioning as an upgrade for any of us. We're all no. doing kind of okay on our armor. So we'll armor. spend to flick through these. another one, an effigy shield. So oh. I've got my eye on this. Oh, okay. This is similar to that shield that we saw from the Assassin Transpose mm -hmm. deck. This doesn't have any dodge on it. Okay. It has one black block and one black resist, but I can be used when you have a two-handed weapon. Which you do. I have, have a two-handed weapon. It only requires 10 strength and 10 faith. I don't need any upgrades to use it. I can do literally it. just chuck it Perfect. straight in. Perfect. So now I am I'm in a pretty good spot. Yeah, so that's the idea. So yeah, so you're wielding a two-handed with this that's kind of attached to your arm. Yep. Um, and because you already have the upgrades, you just can pull this straight on. That's yep. a pretty good We're gonna keep going? Us. Yeah, please. <laughs> one. I've got the loot hunger now. Yeah. Uh, a blood <gasps> gem. So the blood no, gem. No, is that the word I say? <laughs> in terms of the, the, it requires 15 strength to okay. use it. In terms of the conditions we have in the mm -hmm. game, bleed, when you hit someone, when you've got a, something that puts the bleed condition on. Yeah. 
You give them the bleed token. The next time they take damage, mm -hmm. you add two damage to oh, the wow, amount okay. you did. Mm -hmm. So very good against high health types. Yep. Amazing against bosses. Awesome. Very good if you dual wield. Yeah, I'm fine with you. But it does require me spending two in strength. I'm happy to put it to one side for now because yeah. there might be there are yeah. better weapons to put it on than the Mirakumo, or the Mirakumo is a strong candidate. For okay, us. so okay, I'll pop cool. that there for now. We've still got five left, so I'll do another. So oh man, four. more of it. The Sun Princess Ring. So this is from your starting class treasure oh, okay. from the knight. Requires thirty strength and twenty five faith. Okay, I, which I, I, I don't have. have. I don't have the right amount of faith, unfortunately. Uh, and when I end my, when you end your activation, you just gain one health, and I can just straight slot that on now. Oh, <laughs> just wear your. Maybe ring. I should have an upgrade though, and then <laughs> slot it. Oh, but, but these aren't permanent. Ah, these can change, okay. so I can take yeah. it for now. And if you ah, fantastic. Get, get to be able to use get it. Get it on there. Then. So what is it? You, what is it you'd need? You I'd need, need my faith, faith up to tier three. So okay. that's eight. That that right? yeah, yeah. yeah. It's risky because that means we have to keep at least two yep. to gain six from a room and then do it. So that's. Yeah, it's a big jump. So we'll do another flip. Yep. So we've got three left now. The Great Machete. It's all coming up warrior. <laughs> Everything oh, coming up warrior. The machete. It requires 40 strength okay. and 35 dexterity. So oh I would word. need to be oh tier my. three in both of these oh to use word. this. For one stamina, three blue dice. Oh. Oh. It's a range one weapon. It is two-handed. For four stamina, two black, two orange. Or for four stamina... Three blue oh, that okay. hits an entire node. So that is an absolute powerhouse, but it is going to take a lot to get there. So it's going to take sixteen. Okay, so let's let's maybe keep a few, start clearing some rooms. Yeah. Um, keep and, those two. Yeah, and try and um, try and get. I'm if I can get a slightly upgraded shield, I'm more than happy to chuck all the experience points into you yeah. get tier four, and at least then yeah, yeah. I can be tanky and you can damage the, the Sounds devil. Good. So we're going to um, head into this one. So this is what tier is this one? This is a tier two. Yeah, let's yeah, level two. Focus on the tier two. Um, who you killed? So I'm first, right? Did yeah, you kill I the last I think So I, I still I hold first. And I'm happy to go in. Absolutely. Yeah, happy to yeah. go in first. Let's see what we get. So, so we, need, oh, we need a lot of models. A lot of models. We need two silver knight swordsmen. Oh. Okay. We need one crossbow hollow. Ooh. We need a silver knight great bow, and a hollow soldier. So we've got a good mix wow. of. A lot so of guys in here. I'll just cut to the camera for a second while you guys are setting up that room. So here's the Silver Knight Swordsman. So only one health, but two armor. Um, and oh potentially God. five attack with pushes. Wow. And it hits the entire node, so we don't want to be oh. stacking up. Oh my word. So that's the so Swordsman. Where, where do you want to go, Brave Sir Knight? Uh, and the, bo the Great Bowman um, is potentially going to be shooting and moving away. Now, he, does he melee or ranged attack? He has ranged attacks. So he's got infinite range. Okay. But he hits the entire node because wow. the arrows are gigantic. Yeah, so I think... Uh, so he is actually at the front of the room. Just, I think, front and middle, really. You want to go front yeah. and middle? Yes, please. So mm. we'll pop you there. Oh, my goodness. I am going to... So I'm going to be going first. I'm going to be brave. You're going to try and get into that big triple tile? I want to try and... Oh, they're, they're not going to be triple when he, go, when he activates. Uh -huh. it's <laughs> going to be, so this is going to be a lot of movement yep. going on here. Okay. So in terms of the activation order, these guys have the highest threat. Okay. So this first one will go one, two. Okay. It will hit you for five physical damage. Okay, so I'm rolling a black and a blue. Yeah. Oh, I really want an upgrade. Oh, everyone clear their... Uh... Oh, sorry, a blue and a blue I'm actually rolling. Yep. Yes, you are. You've yeah. got that upgraded shield. Yeah. Still, that's pretty decent. So five, and I got four. Oh, so you perfect. take one. Yeah. You do get pushed. Where would you like to go? Um, probably want to come towards you rather than towards the assassin. Now these guys, they do hit areas. Cleave the nodes. So oh, so I get all oh, I can move. Yeah, going there. There. perfect. He keep forgetting that push doesn't have to be away from you. Yep. So yeah. just keeping that in mind. Well, technically that is away from him. It yep. doesn't have to be away from the other guys, gotcha. but it has to be away from him. Again, the second one will move in and hit you for five. Yeah, that's good. Oh. one. Yeah, and he Doing pushes you well. again. So you maybe do you want to come this way yeah. or do you want to come this way? I think. If I, I want to come towards them so they're not going after anyone else. Yep. yep. Yeah, so I'll do that. Into here. Yep. So Do my job. This guy yep. will be going next. So he will just hit you for four physical damage. So you might be lucky. Yeah, yes. So he Block does all nothing. four. Then this fella's going to go. He will shoot you first. So he shoots okay. you for four physical damage. You've just blocked it all and once. Physical, you can do not it magical. Again. Yeah, good. We like physical. We don't like magical attacks. Yep. Hey, we'll take nothing. <laughs> he moves away. And we're going to move him onto... This. Now we're going to move him onto this. Set no, I will go for that one. So I set them up for yeah. a cleave. 
and then this guy will move away from you and shoot you for three magic damage. No! Okay, well, I've got a, a black and a blue for that, so it's not the end of the world. It's only three. It should be good. No. Should take one. Why do you say these things, Alex? Yeah. Well, you just got hit by five guys and took three damage. But, like, I'm a total unit. <laughs> <laughs> so, I go first. Passes over to yep. me. I'm going to move to here for free. Make use of this aggro. And then... Oh, how brave are you feeling? I'm going to spend five. Oh. This system of stamina to health yeah. is just intriguing. The decision making is just so imperative. So, so what are you rolling? So I am one black, two blues on everything here. Awesome. And you got plus one, so they've only got one armor. Okay. They are very, very, oh, very, 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 dead. very, very dead. <laughs> so that's those two gone. Phew. Nice and easy. Lovely. My activation ends. If, because of that ring, if I would taken any damage, I would yeah. recover one. Okay. Uh, so we go to those, and we'll rattle through these nice and quick. Mm -hmm. This guy moves in, he hits me, and I now have four black dice, so he can pass me oh, two. Oh goodness. It's a very all or nothing type of defense you've got going on here. Yeah, max eight, minimum zero. I take nothing Wow. on a roll of six. He pushes me. Uh, you're probably okay taking another yeah, one Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So I'm going to bounce over to here. Okay. Uh, you get hit by this guy. You were two blue, correct? Yeah, that's so right. So he hits you for four. Four. And you take nothing. Oh, and then this. I get shot by him. Okay. He can't move away from me. Yeah, so you stay put where he is. Uh, and I get three black against the magic. Okay. Oh, geez. Oh, oh. <laughs> and I take nothing from him. My word. And mm. then. The aggro passes to Jamie, and we pass over to Jamie. Clean up, Jamie. Uh, I can't really clean this up, so <laughs> I'm just going to move one. Oh, start off with, swap my soul arrow for my Murakumo. So you're using soul arrow and your shield? Yes. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll swap to there. Um, and then I'll blast him. Which one you blast him? Just yeah. uh, the crossbow. Crossbow. Awesome. Yep, uh, just for the free one. So two black dice. Just needing to roll one success, they have no resist. Nice. And he's gone. Yeah. So again, choosing when to use magical, choosing when to use physical makes yep. a big difference. Mm -hmm. uh, back over to them. So you're going to take some hits. That's this okay. guy's going to move in on you. Yeah. And then he's going to hit you for five physical. That's okay. Got two proof for that. Mm -hmm. Can I please have the upgrade that regens health? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> two. You take two, you get pushed. Where would you like to be pushed to? Uh, can I, if I go with. Um, if I go to Jamie's thing, Jamie would end up getting hit, wouldn't I? I'm, I'm nope. getting hit regardless. Yeah. yeah cause so, the, so you're going over there? Yeah. And then he's going to move in and he's going to hit Jamie ah, because sorry, Jamie is Jamie. the sorry. aggro. I'm uh, assuming you're going to dodge. dodge, please. Man, these dodges make me so nervous. Where would you like to dodge to? Uh, I'll dodge down to this corner. Down into the corner. And Nailed successful. Awesome. Takes no damage. And we go back, back over to, to me you again. Guys. Yep. Probably just gonna chill where I am, aren't I really? Because um, then he'll, the other guy will follow me up, won't he? So yeah, dump the guy on the head. Yeah, uh, so I've got no stamina to regain. Um, it's a little risky here to actually do three stamina if we have a look. Like I've got five. I might just go with the zero one just to be safe. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I um, think we're, we're you're tanking it well enough that if need to be, they'll all be on that node. Yeah. Will be, if if you don't kill him, that Alex can do damage to the big hitter, yeah. and then I can finish off a little one. Yeah, so I'm just going to use the zero stamina, one single blue dice then. Yep. Um, and this guy has just one armor? Just one armor. Yep. So, so two, two, two more of a two. Two will kill him. Uh, yeah. Hey. Nicely done. Super um, dead. And because I attacked, I could technically move now, yeah, but it's not going to make any difference. He's going to come to me. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I'll just end Sit my tight. activation. Um, and... Oh no, actually, do you know what? I will move to him. Yes. And then my activation, just for toxic, because I get a health for my Lothric Knight armor. Nicely done. Well, you nice. guys remember I, I need a more prompting. <laughs> I, I forgot to roll my Hornet Ring in my last attack. I forgot about that. These guys. No, <laughs> awful. So he will not move anywhere. Nope. And he will just punch you for five. Yeah, so I'll try and see how I can get on resisting that. Oh yeah, oh, you take nothing. Where would you like to be pushed? Hopefully um, it doesn't matter because I'm gonna yeah, splat him. <laughs> so now it is my activation. Splat is a word not used enough 
in yeah. modern vocabulary. Um, and then I'm going to move in, and I'm going to pay three. Pay five. Do I'll I pay, pay You're five? You're like the devil on the <laughs> shoulder. <laughs> Could I grab two uh, two blue dice in here? There are two oh, blue dice green. in there ready for me. So it's one black, two blue, plus one. Very, 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 very dead. dead. Awesome. That's that done. So I feel, I feel like after one whole scenario, we're kind of... All, obviously nothing majorly wrong when happening. Yeah. We're dealing with level two encounters now, but now we're about to start encountering level three. These threes. are going to be level three, so yeah. you need to crank it up a notch. Um, so we've got six more souls. Six more souls. Um, okay, so what's happening? Should we get you upgraded one of your tiers? Yeah, let's stop pushing for you for the big machete. Yeah. So if we're doing, we've got a, the choices to make are I can either use six to get my decks up, yeah. or I could just spend the whole eight to go up to tier three on my strength. Spend the whole eight to go to tier three. Because we only need six to get you to 25, so that's one more room, yep. and we don't have to carry any over ever yep. again. Well, we will, because I need 35 for the Great oh. Machete. I need two level tier Oh, threes. I thought you'd... Oh, my oh, you're word. The worst. <laughs> so what does the Machete need? The, the Strength 40 and, and 35. Oh, my Strength word. Strength index, respectively. That's a lot of are we gonna get? Are we going to get enough souls to do it? Well, if, if, if we farm the runs, then yes, okay. we will easily get there. Um, so it's entirely up to you guys. Or we can spend them for other stuff. Because I'm doing a lot of damage. Yeah. I don't know how much I need that. The machete's a nice nicety, but... So you need to spend eight, and that's all the eight we have? Eight. Or 16. you could have eight, and you could have the ring. I want the ring. Yeah. What, what do I need to put up for my ring? That would be your faith up to tier four. Oh, Sorry, tier three. Um, oh. Do it. Yeah, I want Treat the ring. Treat yourself. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Treat yourself. And then you can have the ring. Yay! And I have the sun princess ring. You didn't tell me it sounded so girly. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it fit your character well. And I pop that just underneath my armor. Yep. Um, to denote that that's now going to be sitting here. So in my activation, I can else. So I can potentially gain two health every activation if I end with an enemy on my node. It's a good combo. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Cool. Yay. Thanks. So we are ready to go for a, a level three. Let's absolutely. This one. Oh going man. I'm uh, which way are we going in? Who Ooh. killed the last guy? You did. Me. You did, yeah. So you are going to be going first. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I'm going in. You're going first? Yeah, yeah. Now, which door do we want to... We've got a choice of door uh, to go through. Uh, yeah. Both of them get us nice and close to the first spawn. Uh, and which could be good, could be bad. Depends if it's ranged or melee guys that spawn on it. Yeah, yeah. no, I'm good just to come in from that side. I'm not too yeah. concerned. So let's see what we got. Uh, two sentinels. <laughs> <laughs> if anyone watched my reaction in the last video to one sentinel... <laughs> so they just... Both... I'll let you guys pop those So guys. one so... on each node. And then we do have another chest, which well, is good news. I believe we need to get the other one out. I didn't expect to, get, to encounter one. Didn't expect to encounter, encounter two, two sentinels. of them. Okay, so just while you, Jamie, grab the sentinel, I will show the sentinel card again. So if you watched the last video, you would have seen these guys. Ten health, two armor, one resist, and a six damage in the node. Hits everybody on the yeah. node. So these guys, in my opinion, are the mini-bosses of mini-bosses. Um, yep. They terrify me. So, where do you want to stand against your biggest foe? <laughs> <laughs> Brave Sir Knight said he was tanking this. Yeah, yeah, I'm just put me right in the front door. Yep, absolutely. I am going to hide over here. I'm going to join you. Yeah, for <laughs> hiding. So obviously, if we'd come over here, yep. we would be closer than you, absolutely. so he could hit us. Whereas where he is, currently safe. Mm -hmm. So, we can, they're the same type of enemy, so okay. they activate simultaneously. Okay. We choose the order, so sure. we can take advantage of that. And we can just make him wander one to there. Yep. Because obviously this guy pushes, it could chain ah, okay. Now Absolutely. this guy's going to come in, he's going to push you. Where would yeah. you like to be pushed? Come this way, definitely. Over to there. Yeah. And then he's going to hit you for six damage. Okay. We'll see. We'll see how much damage. So it's physical? It is physical. So two so blue. Two blues. Okay, we'll see how much he hits me for. And he hits Oy. you for one. Oh, nice work. Nicely done. This guy, Rose Blocks. Um, and then that is Jamie's activation. Oh, yeah. Right. Now, Jamie, you're going to get two activations, probably. <laughs> Just take it easy, this one. Okay. Just this one. <laughs> okay. Next time, go wild. This time, go right. easy. Uh, I am, they, they only have a dodge requirement of one, so I'm going to swap my Murakumo out for my Soul Arrow, because they have a lower resist than their armor. Yep. I'm going to move a free one to here. <laughs> and they, they can't move on to the chest or the barrels either? Nope. No, okay. I could end up kind of cornered here. Fine. I'll be fine. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I'll, I'll be fine. Um, <laughs> oh, I've not spent that. that oh, no, I just spent you did. You spent your essence. Yeah, oh, first goodness. room. Why would I do that? Why would you do that, Jamie? Uh, I spent four stamina. Yep. To 
make a big blasty attack. Okay. So, so we need three. Three black dice and an orange, please. Oh, Remembering the orange this yeah, time. Yeah, absolutely. So this will be at minus three in minus total, because so I only have two one for the dice, magic one for the resistance. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's good. So that is five damage to health. one of the sentinels. That's so epic. Which sentinels are you shot at? Oh, this one, sorry. So he has taken five damage. See? Cool and calm and collected. You just destroyed it, man. Gonna murk him out. Good. <laughs> chop, 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 chop. So, is that you done? Yes. On yep. to them. So, yep. again, we can take full advantage yep. of this. So, this guy mm -hmm. can go yep. here. Where would you like to be pushed to? So, way that way? Yep. Yep. Chuck okay. you over here. We'll make sure that follows. He hits you for six damage. Now, nah, we'll see. He tries to he hit you. Exactly. For six I'd far prefer that. Oh. Oh, he I does got, hit you for four. I got cocky. But you'll be fine. Uh, so I've got four damage. Okay. The second one. Yeah. We'll move to here and he will hit Jamie because oh. he moves oh, one. He's got a, and oh, then the target okay. would be Jamie because of the aggro token. I will attempt uh, to dodge. Yeah. And I hope to God that I make it. Yep. So, so you, if you got fail this, you are three dead. Three or three? Yep. Three needing oh, one success. So maybe I should have moved between him and Jamie. No, no, no. You'll be fine. Oh, no. Jamie will be fine. I trust. There we go. I trust blank blank dodge. What are, you, are, you, are you contemplating a heroic no, I'll, there? No, I you, want that for... You good? Yeah, I can use that later. So that is that done, and yeah. then yeah. it goes Going over to, me? to as. So I yeah. probably want to bring them towards me and away from you guys. So or, with you being the aggro, yeah. probably going to be the closest. Yeah. You're, you, I think it's safe to say they're probably both coming <laughs> for you. So should I try and get them both in the same tile so you can potentially do a cleave? You can try and, there any way that's gonna try and stack them up. I don't know. You mm. can't. No. no because you can't they push because with their moves. Yeah. You can't stack move them up. On their attack. Um, so do you know what? I'm just going to move in then. And we'll try and see how much I can do to the big guy. Yeah, might as well focus fire onto one person. I'm yeah. quite tempted to use the three stamina and then potentially Estus. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, no, I agree. Um, or I might not even need to because I'm going to regen some health as well. You are going to regen two. two. Yeah, so and I'm going to go for it. you've still got your heroic, so... I mean, and to take this guy, I would need to roll six. So you can... You, I can no, technically you, do it. No, you cannot. Yeah. No, oh, it's minus two. Because it's minus two. Oh, it's two, two armor, not two armor. Oh, so no. the most damage you can do here is four. So you can leave him on one. Right, we'll try it. We'll try it. see what happens. Okay. So, so he doesn't one want to damage. do one. Um, so he's got four health do you know, left. I'm tempted to use the reroll on that one. Oh, no. aggressive reroll. Look at him. He's, no, I'm not going to. He used gonna, to be the tank. He used to be Mr. Reliable. Yeah. Now look at him. <laughs> okay, I'll do no, what I no. want. We'll not use the reroll. So I'll gain health back from the Lothric Knight armor because I've got an enemy on my tile. And then the uh, Sun Prince. And then my Sun Prince. You ended your activation. Um, so that leaves me with four to take two attacks. Yeah. That's a bit risky. That is risky. You do have your luck and you have your heroic. Oh, man. But there's, there's, a, there's, there's potentially two from this one. Two from this one, two from the one oh. before. But round to you, you could potentially take a full I game. Th I think it's. I think I asked us. Yeah, yeah. seems safe. Okay, get that. Out of here. Even though I've got full faith, I don't have that much faith in the dice gods. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so, so this guy. We get to choose which one goes first. Okay. So we could go this guy, and then he will hit you. Yeah. And then, and then when this guy pushes you mm -hmm. off, so we can stack them up, yeah. Yeah. because this guy pushes you ah, off, you come in. here, and then him yep. fall into here. Yes, let's do that. Yep. So that so guy will hit you first. Hits me. So two blue for defense. And he hits you for one. Oh, oh. man. Nice it's always done. the way that when you Estus, you then take no damage. <laughs> so he will push you off, Yep. and then he will move in on you oh, here. Hello. And then you can go wherever you'd like, ideally not on me. Yeah, I think we'll just slide out. Oh my god. And then you guys. get hit. Oh man, I want I want like a sound effect board for these guys charging in and clashing and squeezing me into a little <laughs> night sandwich there. Uh, and you three. Take two. Oh two? Sorry, three, you three, are yeah. correct, they do six damage. Oh. So glad I used my Astus in the end. Yep. Okie dokie. So my go. Come on, man. You got this. Heroic. Oh, really? Oh. In I come. Cleave time. Coming in hot. Could you not swap out for your halberd and then heroic? I don't know if the dice... The dice, I oh, think, no, so is it's, it's got to be a range zero, and that can't do range zero. Yes. So, oh, no. So, no. The rules say no. So, so if halberd, you want to grab that one quickly, zero. that yeah. one yeah. has the shaft icon, which means can't ah. be used at range zero. So, that little icon 
next to those orange dice means you can't use it at range zero. Yeah. My heroic attacks have to be range zero, gotcha. so I literally can't use that weapon. So you're going to give heroic. this to me, is what you're saying? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Sure. Sounds, 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 yeah. A lot, sounds a lot like what you're saying. So it is a two-handed weapon. Made something. for a knight, that one. Yeah. Made for a knight. <laughs> so I'm going in. I'm getting my two blue, yep. one black dice. Oh. For free, I've spent no stamina to do this. I'm at plus one, so this is dice minus one, and this damage on is going on both, both of, them. of them. Oh, yes. And I wow. take away one, so that is five damage each, which oh, kills this one. Nicely done. And puts five damage onto the other one. Nice work. I feel like the warrior's putting us a little bit to shame here, Jamie, I'm not going to lie. Um, That's I'm not a challenge. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Not Whoa. for the lack of trying. <laughs> so that's my activation over with my yep. no stamina still move used. if you want. I could still move, and I'm not going to. Okay. I'm going to sit tight. I'm going to move one, actually. Okay. Play my little. Oh. Just so I can take him over towards Jamie. So he will activate. Nice. He will move into here. I'm going to get pushed over to there, and then he's going to hit me for six. And I get my four black dice. Come on. And I take wow. nothing with a seven. roll of seven. That's incredible. Good work. Jamie, over to well you. Well done, over sir. to me. Finish uh, him. I'm going to swap my Murakumo out for my shield. And I keep the same dodge, so it's fine. <laughs> yep. I feel like we need to give this some kind of tagline. There needs to be a shout that comes with you dual wielding. It's like... <laughs> Free one, spend one to get in. Yeah, the only person that's done it successfully so far is you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's fair. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm going to make my free soul arrow attack. Okay. Okay. So that's two black dice and an orange. So I'm at minus three for this roll. Okay. Come on, orange dice, do me proud. Mm -hmm. Oh, so one damage. One. Okay, every little counts. And then more health. <sighs> You're just setting them up for me to do a wheel kill again. Yeah, yeah. I'll yeah. do my three Mirakuma attack because if I, yeah, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Uh, I need three black dice and an orange dice. I'll be fine. 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 This is at minus four because of, it's against the physical armor, and it's nothing. I do nothing. Jamie. Hey. <laughs> Jamie. I just want to do something cool. <laughs> won't let me <laughs> the game invites that though it's thematic yeah. it's dodgy it's fast it invites doing one of these on the I'm waiting awesome. for Jamie to go for a dodge against this attack and then use his heroic and to <laughs> absolutely <laughs> blast him with soul arrow and finish that's, him off that's, that's what I'm thinking <laughs> well, so, we obviously are fighting a main boss here yeah. so the potential for us to potentially sort of potentially for us to potentially reset and clear a couple rooms again to get more stuff is a viable I, strategy I've not got an Estus and you've not got an Estus and we will I will, I will say it with some confidence, not beat the Dancer without our Estus first. Okay. Yeah, she yeah. does a lot of damage. Good to know. All so, right. so you will get pushed off first. Mm -hmm. And Oop, then he will oopa, follow oopa, after oopa. you and push you again. Push me again? What a jerk. <laughs> <laughs> and then he will hit you for six. And I will dodge onto the barrel. Smash. <laughs> so painful. Please dodge. dodge the attack first. So... You still have your reroll, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Just need him one. Oh, okay. nailed it. Gets oh, it. Heroic. Easy. And he's using his heroic. So your heroic basically lets you have an out of activation attack yep. without costing any stamina. Yeah, oh. correct. Yep. Okay. I'm at minus three to this. Minus three. So armor and the arms dice. Oh! <laughs> and with the, with the minus three. That is the max roll. That is ten damage down to seven. Oh. <laughs> Scripted. Witness me! <laughs> Scripted. He's dead. Wow. We killed them both. We get a chest. We get six souls. Yes. Yes. Finally. Yes. Good man. Good use of a heroic. Yeah. The two pieces of equipment we get, we get a sharp gem. Bags. Okay. If you have 25, sta uh, 25 dexterity, you gain an additional oh. black dice on a weapon. Okay, I think we should put that at the bottom of the deck and forget about that one. No one yeah. wants that. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Just, I want this deck throw it. Sharp this. I'm going to equip that straight onto my Murakumo. That seems like a good choice. So, so now he gets a lot of black dice. That's so, so just to check, so weapon upgrades and armor upgrades, are they permanent. different? They're permanent? So, sorry, weapon upgrades are permanent. Yeah. Once you put it on a weapon, it's on there. Right. Armor upgrades, because they're rings, you take you them just, off as much as you like. Cool. Okay. They can be shifted around. Oh, so you're, you're, you're committing to the Miyakumu? Oh, yeah. The thing I, I if, if I make an attack in a boss's weak spot, five I roll five dice black dice. And an orange. And an orange dice. 
It's good. Okay, we're feel, I feel like we're gearing up for the boss really nicely and then here. And we get an ember. Okay. Oh, so oh. that yes. will give us. We've got tokens here. Okay. We need to choose one of us. Okay. One of us will gain this token, which is what the slot on the character board right, in the okay. bottom left hand corner is yeah, for. Yeah, see that? When you take damage, when you have an ember, mm -hmm. you take three or more damage, you reduce that number by one. So it makes Ooh, you a bit okay. tankier. Mm. But you don't want to put it on your tank, generally. Yeah, because, I mean, we you, take one or two. Like one or two. Yeah. I think it's better on you. because I, I don't know. I don't know if it's... It's a tough call between you two. Yeah. Like, I almost feel like if you don't dodge, you're dead anyway. Well, that's, <laughs> that's why I was thinking yourself. Yeah. You're, you're more likely to take a three or more. Yeah. Well, because I, I could. I have the lower you, reliable the, because yeah. I'm using black dice. Yeah. Yeah. I, would, I, I absolutely Okay, agree. so I'll take that. And that's our two from that chest. Nice. So that chest is done, but we do have six souls. We haven't. I mean, we had the great machete, but I don't really know. There's nothing else in our inventory that we really are loving right now. So hmm. I could... I mean, I could either start working towards it, or we can just flip a load. Yeah. Okay. Because Jamie, <laughs> yeah, think... Jamie could maybe do with the different ones with his soul arrow. Yeah. Let's let's yeah. do it. Let's see what else is in that. So the first. Because we still got all the, the mini bosses kind of stuff to come up. I know we've got. We've got a lot of the transpose okay. stuff to come yeah. up. Um. So we've got a crystal gem. Okay. If you, it's the same as the sharp gem, mm -hmm. apart from this one works on intelligence. So okay. if you have twenty-five oh. intelligence, you can put it on a weapon to give it an extra black die. We we have little we're, intelligence we're here. Yeah. Another one, which is a spider shield. So it has no resist, but mm -hmm. two black dice on block. Ooh. You are immune to poison when you have it. 27 strength and 15 intelligence. No good for me. Really. No good. No. Another it's one. The intelligence is holding us isn't back. It? Isn't yeah, it? we're lacking in intelligence right now. Yeah. The boulder side sword. So this is from the My Transpose okay. deck. Cool. 33 strength, 23 dex. Okay. One-handed, for zero stamina, you get two blue dice. Ooh. Oh. For four stamina, you get to move one node. It's two orange dice okay. at range one. So just, what? Um, and that's one-handed or two-handed? That's a one-hander, and it comes with one magic block on that, it. I know you said that was in your deck. But, but I think it's a good fit I, for you. Because you've currently got the two-hander with the buckler. The buckler's only okay, though. The buckler's not amazing. Uh, but that I don't know. It's given... I, I'm, so what stats do you need for that? 33 strength and 23 decks. So oh. you're going to need a tip. But it's a, it's a good... This is like an end-game weapon. So once you've got that, we can kind of shift focus and I'm start. Yeah. So um, we've got three left. Okay. So we'll do one more flip. Just to bring it to an even number, and, stop and then we can give you two to yeah. put your decks up to yeah. start working towards cool. it. So I'll leave that with you, and you can show the weird icons oh, to the goodness. camera yeah, if you'd it's like. Pretty, it's pretty awesome, actually. Um, so that second ability, as you mentioned, so that's the one that lets you move one, two orange dice, and then hit at a range of one. Because normally it's a range of zero. Wow. And also that two blue for nothing. Is unbelievable. That's so the same as your three, three stamina, stamina on your that's, current weapon. Oh, okay. We'll keep that on the back burner. So yeah. and our other flip is the simple gem. This yeah. is one of my favorites. If you have 15 faith, yeah. so a weapon upgrade, mm -hmm. you reduce the cost of the weapon it's attached to's highest stamina attack by one. <sighs> So, for example, uh, if I had an additional upgrade slot on here, yeah. my five stamina attack would be four stamina. Yeah. If we look back at that amazing machete, yeah. it has two four stamina attacks, which are loads of dice. Okay. Both of those would only cost three Wait, now oh with that goodness. upgrade. So, really nice one for once you get those nice Maybe weapons. weapons. Might yeah. be decent on that, if I'm 100% yeah. honest. one upgrade slot, so yeah. could... Reducing the cost yeah. of that big attack to From three to rather three. than yeah. four. Yeah, and then we've got the two here. Mm -hmm. And they are to upgrade your dexterity up to Thank tier you. one. Get started on it. And then the next room, okay. we could spend four of those six to get your dex to where it wants yeah. to be, and then hold on to the other two, do the other room, oh. and then get your big fancy sword. Awesome. Do right. we want to? Well, do we want to reset and potentially just rail through these rooms again quickly, and then we can kind of carry on to this one? Yeah. Yeah. Would that yeah. work? Yeah. And um, so we can that. basically go back and rest, reset both our rests, yep. and then we're not risking anything at all. Yep. Um, so yeah, guys, we'll take a quick break there. We're going to reset the board. We're going to go back to the start, give it another go, and we're going to collect ourselves some more souls, and then we're going to dive into another tier three room. So we will catch you after this break. Hey guys, and welcome back after the break. So we have actually gone through, and we have taken out the same three rooms we've done before. So we basically yep. went through two tier twos and a and tier and a level three. three with the big sentinels. Um, so yeah. that gave us another eighteen souls. Yeah. Yep. So we did a few draws, and then we also then I'm a little excited to say got my strength decks up 
So I now have, just to show it again, um, what we were talking about before the break, the boulder sword now. Yeah. Um, which has given me the first opportunity for me to get an orange dice in. Um, and we've also added the gem, which is going to reduce the cost of that main four stamina attack down yep. to three. Um, so we're now about to head into the room before the boss. Yep. So this is the, the... We haven't seen this one yet. No, yeah. So this is a brand new room. Um, um, would you like to thank... So we've got Jamie going first. Yep. So mm -hmm. would you like to Absol thank... Absolutely. So... We'll pop that onto you. Let's and go, I'll pass in. it over and you guys can tell Let's me. Let's see what's in what there. Look like. So it's trapped. So oh, that's a great oh, start. Okay, so and we this... need two, three. That oh, there's actually a yeah, more. that one there. So it'll be five traps in this okay, room. Okay, so I'm going to randomly choose. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. It's just hollow central. This room is chock a block with big brave boys. Uh, is that, you can keep me right. Is that that's the five? Uh, oh, not, not that one. Oh, not that one. So yep. just. Oh, this one. And the one in the top yep. corner. Love it. Can we, st we keep away from the entrances? Yeah. Oh, so we need okay. each one of these groups so on each one of those what? spawn points. And then one Jimmy. barrel. Oh, my word. Nice welcoming party as yeah. we enter the room. Yeah, pretty, pretty friendly. And then we'll have this barrel on the node at the top. Okay. So uh, where would you like to stand? I mean, I've been given a pretty sword and I'm there to take damage. I'm pretty much going to stand. Front and center. At the front door. I mean, I'll go in the scary. Why, why change the habit of a lifetime? We'll you know? hide. <laughs> <laughs> so brave. And so. just brace. Now, I've, so I've used my Estus flask. Well, unfortunately, like we, did, we went through the three rooms again. Didn't have a perfect time, but I've used my Estus flask. Everything else I think we still have. Yeah, I've yeah, played conservative still got, for once. Still got my ember. Intact. I haven't used anything. <laughs> I love conservative for once. Yeah. Uh, that, um, so I, from seeing this room, though, that is going out the window again. <laughs> yeah, you're going to go <laughs> look wild. <laughs> yeah. Um, so we now have to resolve them in order. So it will be the big guys first. Okay. We get to choose. So if we move him first, and he'll just come down to this node with this trap on it here. Oh, why are the trap nodes? So he's gone. Yep. Then this one's going to come in. Okay. And he's going to push you. Yeah. And you can go wherever you would like. You can go to the node that he came from. You can yeah. go to this purple one. You can come on to our node. If you come on to us, you're going to get shot twice, but yeah. the other hollows aren't actually going to hit us. Um, because there's no, nothing area I'll, damage wise. Oh, if I, yeah, because I'll move out of range of both of their yep, movement yes. then. So I think I will do that. Yeah. Yep. Um, so you get pushed to there. That is a five five damage push. Because that's part of their push. Yep. Like, so it's not an attack, it's actually their movement dealing damage and pushing you. Yep. Um, okay, now I actually have two blues still for my defense. My new boulder sword did actually give me one extra resistance, but no extra armor. Yep. Um, okay, so let's see what I can do with this. Okay, take so two. So take two. That's all right. It's not so bad because you're going to heal that straight back up, right? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, so with the armor and the armor upgrade, I have a potential if I end my turn with models to heal two or more because it's per model. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So. so this guy will move into here. Yep. The other hollow will follow his friend. So oh, yeah. Yep. Can he move? One. Yeah, he can move that far. Yeah. Oh, he's moving oh, from he's here. Yeah. Red yeah. One. Oh my goodness, there's so many of them. And then this guy will go back to here. Okay. Shoot you for three magic. Oh, lovely. So I'm now rolling, uh, my armor is one blue. One black and one blue. And one black from my new sword. Yeah, that's nice. Let's see what we're going to get. So you take nothing. Three. Nice, absorb all of that. And then the other one is going to move across to that trap node. Okay, yeah, this one here. Yep. Move away. And then he's going to shoot you. Okay, also. same again. Yep. Oh, he will one. do one damage. Okay, it's not too bad. So that's them all gone. Jamie, you're up. I'm up. Please don't be down. So just, just remember, one turn of calm. No. And if you get a second activation, you can go nuts. No. So, no. so soul arrows going in. Shields coming out. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm gonna free move on to join this node with them. Yeah. Spend one to go onto the pink node, if you wouldn't mind. Yeah. Spend another one to go and reveal that trap and get onto the same node oh, as him. Oh, so this trap. Is oh, it actually does have oh, one dodge. damage with a dodge value of one. So, are you going to try and dodge it, or are you just going to uh, take, I'm the, one take damage? the damage? Because I want to be okay. So we, we leave it there. Oh yeah, the trap there. Oh, so is that a permanent fixture of that? So note now he that will stay there. So we know that. So ah. when we reset, we know don't stand on that one. It's okay. a trap, or at least send the assassin. Be calculated. Okay. Like, we like we know it's a trap, but I know I can take one damage. Sure. Um. I am more than one node away from both of those groups of fighty hollows, aren't you I? You are. So I so won't get hit safe. by them. 
So I am going to spend... Jamie's going to clear out the ranged, the ranged support. And do you have to roll to dodge the trap? If he I wanted to. I'm, I'm just going to take the damage, though. Cause, oh, cause if he, rather than the stamina. Because either way, it's going to be one damage. It's either going yeah. to be one stamina or one, one damage. Yeah. Or if he was really unlucky, could be one stamina and one damage. If he so failed to dodge. Just ah. take the one damage. Nice. No, absolutely. Uh, so I'm going to use my free soul arrow okay. to splat the... One that's standing. One that's standing the, one uh, the oh, crossbow one? hollow. Yeah. Get rid of these ranged guys. Yeah. So if I could have two black dice and an orange dice, please. There's one black. And there's an orange and another black. Thank Ooh, you. Sorry. Uh, and minus two to this. Okay. He dies. Oh wow! Yeah. Awesome. And then I'm gonna make a heavy attack against the other guy. Oh sorry, you, that was against this guy. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So you're gonna sorry. have it. Sorry. I'm gonna use my sword to stab this guy. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, if I could have two more. Black dice, oh please. my word! Um, he's got just one armor. Just one armor. That might have been when we missed when we were yep. talking through the changes that happened when we were going through. Yep. We also from the loot deck got a sharp gem, which is ah, a, uh, a weapon upgrade for Jamie's Murakumo because he yep. has twenty five decks mm -hmm. or higher. He's able to attach that to his Murakumo, and he now gets an additional black dice on top yep. of the bucket of black dice <laughs> he was already rolled. So for my heavy attack, it's three black dice, plus one for the sharp gem, and then the orange dice at minus two. Wow. So my dice total is this, minus three. Okay. Yeah, and I can... absolutely more than So that is another one, very dead. So the ranged guys, yep. they're down. Now we've just got these kind of clusters of guys that are going to be hopefully nice and grouped up yep. for me to go in and... Yep. Do some work. Okay, so now Jimmy has aggro. What's going to happen? Well, so I am. You guys are the closest. We're going to yeah. be the ones that oh, take okay. these. So unfortunately, mm -hmm. these guys with their attack, yep. it's not targeted. Okay. Anyone they push. Oh no. So we're both going to get hit bit hit by one of these. Okay. So we will say this guy comes in. He's going to push Ooh, us. Or could we? Oh no, there's no way we can get away from these no. guys. So he's going to push us both, but we can split off here. So only ah, one of them okay. hits both. And there's no way we could have pushed, gone with this guy first and pushed us out this way so he couldn't have reached? Yes. But, oh, you've got me meta yes. Look what you're doing to me, Alex. So if he comes in and pushes us both here, we then avoid him? Yep. yep. So he uh, comes in yeah. and we stay stuck together. I'll take, I'll take a wee self high five yeah, for that. Yeah, yeah nicely done. Um, so, in terms of this, I if you want to roll your block first, sure. you've got all the dice over by you. Oh, sorry, I, really, I am hoarding all the dice right now. So two blue. Looking to avoid five. Yeah. So you take, take one. one. Okay. And then if you can pass me four black <laughs> dice, please. There you go. Open. There you go. And the change that's happened for me, we looted an ember. Yeah. So an ember is a card that you draw that enables you to place another token. Yeah. If I take three damage or more from this guy, I reduce it by one. Nice. But the easiest thing in the world to forget. So I'm explaining it again to myself <laughs> to remind me. So I will take two damage. My so ember doesn't trigger, yeah. so I still take the two. Okay. After I was rolling so well on these blocks, <laughs> it's finally <laughs> failed me. Um, right. The next one. Yeah. So this he's going to come over me, isn't he? This one will move towards Jamie. That's okay. Because yep. he has fine. the yep. aggro. And then this guy move will me. also move towards That's Jamie. Right. I'll come over and... And then this guy is yeah. going to come in on us two. Sure. So he's just going to hit you. You yep. are the highest taunt. Hi, yep. I will give you that back. So and you need two blues. And he's what my four damage? Four damage. Okay. No you damage. Take nothing. nothing. All good. Love it. And that is over to your activation. Okay. Oh, that's fantastic. So my thought, just to check something with you, I can attack and then move. Yes. Can I also, even after I attack, exert a stamina to move? Yes. Yeah. So you can. It, as you basically got one instance yeah. of each. each. So you can attack. As hard with yeah. as up to two weapons, sure. And then you could run as far as you like. You could also say you've spent four stamina mm -hmm. with attacks. Yeah, you've taken no damage, so you've got six left. Cool. You could run like five nodes, okay. estus, and then ah. run another nine. <laughs> Not that you ever would, but you could. You can estus. <laughs> if you want to do you some like. laps, just to yeah, yeah. some victory laps, victory laps. Because my thought is try and take this guy out here, and then potentially move over to the the two guys on the same tile. So I'll gain three health back. From that, um, it's only going to cost me one stamina to do that, isn't it? Maybe one and then one across. You'd get two health back. Um, oh no, you are correct. Three model, because yeah. you've got your one at the end of the activation. So yeah. yes, yeah, that so seems that's, like a solid plan. I mm -hmm. will just go ahead then. So with my Balder Sword now, a zero stamina attack will give me two blue dice start. That's amazing. Yep, so, pretty good. Yeah, previously my Morning Star was giving me three stamina. Three for stamina for the two, two blue. For the same. Now I'm getting two blue for zero stamina. Mm -hmm. Oh, that is that is good. I like Luke. 
So let's see. He dies. Oh, he's just, dead. oh goodness, just a bite. He couldn't, I don't think I could have feel that, could I? No, no, nope. you, you, uh, you weapon's so good, you just instantly. <laughs> so then you wanted to move over. So you're yes. going to go over a trap. Which one? Uh, oh, which one? Why did, oh man, uh, fine. this one. You're going for that one, so flip the token. It's clear. Oh, it's so clear. we know the one in the middle is clear. That's good. The middle yeah. node is clear. That opens yeah. up a lot Makes, of... Yeah. And then Challenge. you wanted to move Spend one there. stamina to move into there. And then you end your activation. So end of my activation, thanks to my armor, I'll gain, uh, well, for the armor itself, I will gain one health for each enemy unit in my node, so that's two. Mm -hmm. And then I'll, because of the upgraded uh, Sun Princess ring, I'm going to get another health at the end of my activation, so three. Oh, very nice. Nicely yeah, done. That's very efficient. Tasty. Things for free are good. <laughs> Who knew? So we go over to their activations. Yep. So this is nice. in terms of the way we want to do this, we can get you to tank both guys yeah here. definitely and i believe we can corral them together so you get pushed from this one so and if you were to come down to here gonna, but if i if i wasn't to go there i, I would avoid an attack so you're going to make true. me take an extra attack but then you've got the opportunity to potentially hit books at the same time kill everything. i'm good with that i think i think i'll survive it i don't know if i can cleave i can cleave both of these guys yeah, yeah. i don't know if you'll be able to get both of these guys um, will he not move into my space well when, when the big hollow moves in he's yeah. going to push you again yeah okay Oh, yes, of course he is. Oh, but you could get pushed onto his, then he pushes you back and you so, come back across. Yeah, so if I go here and he then comes in and pushes me, oh, he'll be in the wrong space. You best, but yeah. if you come here. Yeah, I think I agree with you, yeah. He will come in, yeah, push, push you. Me. You can get pushed onto here. Yeah. And then when he pushes you off, when he starts his activation, you get there. pushed back over here. And then he comes in <laughs> and then I go <laughs> in and muller them all. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, good, good, good. So five damage yep. from the, the boy here. Big one. Oh, one game out and one. So you take two. That's not too bad. Then this guy will activate. Yep. He shoves you off Absolutely. to start. And then he moves into here. Lovely. And then you can go pretty much wherever you like from there. Um, yeah, I'll go back to here again. Back over this way. Oh, but then will he go after Jamie? That's fine. Yeah, no, no, let's, let's stay in. Yeah, I want to take the hits. Here? Yeah, perfect. And, and then see. five. So you take another one. Um, and then that sword hollow won't yeah. move anywhere. Just hits you. For four. Four damage. No, it doesn't. Nothing. Yeah. So you take nothing. So nicely that done That wasn't there. too bad. Yeah, that was a bit of a, a lot of blocking and moving, blocking and moving. I very much like the sort Jiggly of thematic. Pokery. Yeah, no, I like it. So, me. Yeah, do it. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to move for free to here, then I'm going to spend one to come into here. Yep. Then I'm going to spend five to go for my node attack. Yes. And I'm going to try and one-shot both of them. Yes. Because it will be awesome. Please work. <laughs> so, could I have one black dice, please? Yeah. So I'm rolling two blue, one black. I'm at yeah. plus one because I, my Titanite yeah. shard. So they have no armor. I'm okay. at straight dice. I've and one shot five, one of you before. Health, yeah. <laughs> I will one shot you both this time. Upping the game. Oh! oh seven they both take seven damage, and I one shot the pair of them. It's good. Nice work. Wow. I'm pretty happy about that one. Not going to lie. Oh my my activation over. Yeah. I don't need to worry about doing anything about this, though it looks pretty horrendous with me only having two <laughs> two squares mm -hmm. left. Yep. We're actually pretty good because you're going to take the hit from yep. that guy. Cool. So he will hit you because you are closer. So with four physical damage again. One. And you just one. take the one, and then we go to Jamie's activation, and you're going to clean up, right? Now, going into the boss fight, do we want our tank to have... First turn. Ideally not. So, so some tactics coming. So in. what I'm going to do You're is gonna I'm going to hold I'm going to trust here. you to take one more hit. I'm just going to heal my two. Okay. I'm just going to watch. Ah, okay. And this means then he'll go now. Then it'll be my turn, and it means you will be first. And then you finish, and I'll you be finish. First. Oh, okay. Oh, this is good. See, so right after one scenario, we're starting to see little tricks of the trade that can ensure that you don't get people just one shot or just absolutely destroyed yep. at the gate. Yep. So I'll roll again then. So he will hit you again. Dodge it all. Take nothing. Absolutely fine. And then you would recover your one stamina at the start of your activation. Yeah. And then you get to hit him. I'd like to think this should be okay. Oh, you, you Are you going to use your fancy attack? I'm going to use my fancy attack. Yeah, so so usually it'll be four stamina, but my upgrade is going to reduce it to three. Yep. Um, and this oh. is going to give me two. So you get to move. So you even get to show off because it gives it range <laughs> one. So you can move over here. Yep. And then you basically, it's, it's supposed to be a, it's like a lunging attack. Gotcha. So it's like a lunge forward, which is why it has that range one when ah. the weapon is usually range zero. And I mean, 
we're rolling these just for posterity because yeah, they are you cannot fail. These are massive. Um, How many times armor. do you kill him? Not that much. So you do a total of four, down to three. So you you still kill him we, three we, times. We kill, over. we kill him enough. Over. We kill him enough. Times. So we get six souls from that. Yep. Yes. Is there? And we do a big big clear over yep. here. Oh, Did anyone yeah. use luck? No. So we don't need to spend that. No, I still got mine. Did anybody? No, did anybody? Did Does anybody. anybody need anything? I don't need anything, but I'm feeling pretty good. Like we're both in pretty good shape. Yeah. Jamie, you need some. Yeah, you need my, some my, goodies. My soul arrow could do with being replaced by a better weapon. Okay, okay. so how many do we have left over from last time? Do we have any? Nope. No, 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 we spent okay. more. Pulled them all in. Kept so, flipping. So we go for a flip. Yep. Yeah, absolutely. let's do some flips. So, so down to five right souls. So down to five. The falchion. So. This is a, a really nice transposed piece of equipment from the night deck. Right, okay. Um, it requires a lot. 37 <laughs> strength, 30 that. dexterity. Wow. Need that. Just short on that. 23 faith, which Ooh, you do have. Yeah. Zero stamina gets you two blue dice. Okay. That's so the same as the sword, yeah. Three stamina gets you two orange dice. Ooh. So it matches up with your sword. Yeah. Your sword's slightly better on the yeah. offensive. However, this does give you one black dice block. And one blue dice resist, magic. Blue and dice magic. it has two uh, upgrade, upgrade slots. So let me just have a quick look at that and pop that under camera for a second. Yeah, no so if I wanted to use this, what? So I'm missing. I've got the strength. It's You've got the faith. Uh, I've got the faith, and just one shy on the dexterity, and that would require my tier three, which would be eight souls. Yep. We only have five currently. Four. Oh, I've got five. Five. I'm happy to hold. Wait, wait yeah. for it. We'll see. If had you not got that boulder sword, <sighs> that my would eyes be... would leap out at that. But that yeah. boulder sword's such a good weapon. But if if we don't manage to get the boss first time, then we're going to have to yeah. come back through and then yeah. if you get enough to get it. So that's yeah. yeah. Oh, that's, so oh. another flip. Another flip. Let's have a look. So you give me it's a weapon. It's a great magic weapon. So this is basically like a spell that acts as a weapon. Buff. Sure. Um, for zero stamina, so you, you kind of have to dual wield with yeah. it. For zero stamina, Captain your Joel attacks here, gain yeah. magical. <laughs> or for two stamina, your attacks gain plus one damage and are magical. Oh, wow, okay. So What's the intelligence 12? 12, 12, I have that. 12 in and 12 faith. 12 faith. I'd need to spend two to get the faith up. I'd be well up for doing that. Do you yep. think that is better than your soul arrow? Because that's essentially the trade you're looking at. Yeah. I mean, I'm happy to put that to one side. Okay. And if we, when we get down to two souls... See what, we're see, what, see what we've got. Yeah, absolutely. We might get so something else. Another one? Yep. <laughs> will be the Rotten Gru Dagger. Ooh. Um, so it's an earlier piece of equipment from the Assassin okay. deck. Yeah. Zero stamina, it's two black dice, minus one. And poison. But it poisons things. Okay. And then for three stamina, it's three black dice, minus one, and also poisons with only one upgrade slot range. I'm not sure if it's a I, big no, upgrade. No, it's not. It's not. James I, I'd rather keep this whole arrow so I can... Fight from the, the Interestingly, yeah. there's a nice combo with it. Yeah. If you were to put the blood gem that we got earlier on okay. it, poison yeah. does proc bleed. Oh, wow. So poison does one damage when an enemy ends its activation. Okay. So yeah. you put on poison a weapon that poisons bleed. with a bleed gem, you poison them and bleed them with the attack. <sighs> the poison goes off and the poison goes up to three damage. Wow, so you're guaranteed three damage. Oh, my goodness. So it's a really nice combo. We just so need can, to find you a weapon to... Yeah. Well, if it needs to be that, that that's available. Yeah. And, and I, you've got I, I stats for it already. Yeah. Yeah. So that's that's a potential. Sure. Just mm -hmm. three guaranteed damage is never a bad thing. Absolutely so. not. Um, so we've got three souls left. Yep. We'll go for another one. Oh, it's your weapon again. Oh, boy. So it's a war pick. Okay. Uh, 35 strength, 25 dex. Yep. Can you use that? I can. The wheeled knight? Question mark? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Maybe. So... For one stamina, it's one blue, one orange. Okay. For four stamina, it's one blue, two orange with one upgrade slot. It's one-handed wow. but range zero, so that's a, a heavy hitting weapon. Oh my goodness! Go for another. Okay. Are we going yeah. for another one? Yeah, we... I'm, I'm not too bothered about this great magic weapon. Okay. Okay. So it's number umbral dagger. Just got a full This inventory. has a dodge on it. Okay. Oh, okay. Jamie, thirty-five dex. <sighs> And 35 intelligence. Oh no. For zero stamina, it's two blue dice minus one. Mm -hmm. For two stamina, it's two orange dice minus one. My word. For three stamina, it's one blue and two orange dice minus one. It's got a dodge on it, which is the bit that's exciting yeah, yeah, yeah. because Jamie yeah. can get to four dodge and always and have dual wielding. Um, especially if he puts the blood gem yeah. 
on yeah. this one because it chop, does chop. have an upgrade slot. Um, so why don't we I potentially am... spend our last soul for last reveal? Yeah. yeah. And then we'll go and meet the dancer. And if we don't have it this time, yep. we hopefully yep. have an inventory strong enough to <gasps> fill up. Okay, it's, it's, an, it's the, the next flip. It's 35, for 35 decks and 25 intelligence, yep. which is easier for easier, Jamie yeah, to yeah. access. Um, it's the Carthus Curved Sword. Okay. It also has a dodge on it. Oh. It has one upgrade slot. And then it's got some nice damage options. It's got a two blue damage minus one for one stamina, and you get to move after the attack. So it's good for going yeah. in and disengage yeah. afterwards. For three stamina, it's the three blue dice minus one. You're, are you only one upgrade away from able to have that it's one two, then? two, so, so I need 14. Okay. And then it's got a zero stamina option to just move 12. twice. That's cool. But yeah. what's interesting is that doesn't count as your move. Oh, it counts as wow. an attack. So, so when can... it comes to the boss and getting into their arcs, that could be really huge. Yeah. So I'll leave that with Jamie as well. Yeah. Did you want to pop on the... Or uh, do we want to hold on to the blood gem now we've got those? Hold on to the blood gem now we've got yeah. them. Oh yeah, so there's no point to taking the, the poison dirty daggers, yeah. whatever they were called. Wow. The, the, the range of options is crazy. Yeah. Like, that's fantastic. So now... We just either need to kill the boss or prepare to get more souls. Yeah. <laughs> so the boss, the main boss, takes yeah. place in a jewel room. It's two awesome. tiles put up together. Cool. So we will take a little break here. We're going to get prepared for the main boss, guys. You come back and join us just in a second, and we're going to take on the dancer and see how that goes. We'll see you in a second. Hey guys, and welcome back. You're joining again me, Alex, and Jamie. We have not decided to go back and rest to the bonfire and reclaim any rooms. We are going straight into the boss as it stands just when you left us before the break. So we now have the main hall. And as you mentioned, this is going to be a double room because yeah. this is a main boss, not a mini yeah. boss. Yeah. Um, you are the player to activate, Alex. But I'm going first, so I'm guessing you're tanking. Yeah, I'm going to hop in as the first victim. What do we need to do then to get the dancer ready to fight? So much like the mini boss that we, we saw, her deck, her starting deck consists of five okay. rather than four. And that is of 10 cards. So, super. so hers is, in oh. terms of what it can and can't be, there's a lot of variation. Okay. In there. So um, we're going to see five out of a 10 possible. And that's her base. Yeah. Before then, we look at her heat up. Heat up. And the heat up would add a sixth in. And then we also look at her special rule, which means that the deck gets shuffled a lot once oh. she's heated up. Okay. Yeah. Um, she's super unpredictable. She's got two armor and two magic resistance. Yeah. 34 health. Oh my word! She heats up on 18, but we're pretty we're pretty geared up. I think yeah. we can churn through that relatively quickly. I think the so damage output I'm really happy about the, the the damage soaking is what I'm maybe worried about. Hmm. Um, uh, yeah, I just swap my stuff around to so make sure I got full four dodge to begin with. Okay, so that's the five random cards. Did we get any gravestone? Oh, yeah, we got one gravestone, I believe. Uh, there it is. There it is. Yeah. Peak. So yeah. we get to see one of these. Uh, Jamie, do you want to pick out one? Uh, is Double Slash. So okay, this is a new mechanic we haven't seen yet. There okay. is an icon in there, in the middle, the little sort of circle yeah. with the tunic. That means she does that twice. Oh, wow, okay. So she will move forward, not targeting anyone. She okay. just moves forward in whatever yeah. direction she's facing. She'll push them. She will do a 90-degree turn. Wow. And then she will hit the area shown in green for five physical damage. It's a dodge value of one, and it's okay. range one. And does she then just do that all again? Just then she would again. move forward again, turn, and hit. So potential 10 damage. Yep. Wow. If you stand in okay. the wrong place. Yeah, all right. Yeah, so yeah, so if we get any new mechanics, we'll show them. If, if there's yep. stuff we've seen before, we'll kind of just carry on, guys. Yep. Um, this so oh. where are we standing? Um, well, it has to be one of the three entrance nodes, doesn't it? Okay, yes. I'll go in the, this corner here. Thank you. Are you, are you yeah. big brave boy? We know where I'm going. Brave tonight. I mean, right in the middle. Throw me on the other, other corner. End. So her name, her size of her deck, and just... The feeling from that first card we've seen, we can tell she's going to be highly mobile, kind of unpredictable. Yeah. Cool. This is awesome. Looking forward to this. So a special rule is called unpredictable onslaught, which <laughs> gives you some idea of what's what's going to happen here. Well, what's, what's to be wow. expected? So she's going to go. We're mm. all set up. The yep. aggro token is on you. Yeah. Uh, grab that. No problem. So you want to go ahead and reveal her well, first. Geez. Indeed. Have we eaten it? So what is her first attack? Her first attack. So this is, I guess this is kind of a new one that we haven't seen yet. Because she had, the bosses have the arcs, mm -hmm. she has the ability to move sideways. Oh, okay, yeah. So she doesn't target anybody. Okay. She's just going to move one 
that way. Okay. Cha -cha. So she's going to move across to that side. All right. Then she would make a targeted attack at someone that is in range one. We're all at a range. Okay. We're not going to get hit by this. No problem. For seven physical damage. What's that called? That is called Deadly Grasp. Wow. It sounds pretty deadly. Um, she is weak in the same arc as, that she moved to. So she's going to be weak in the left arc okay. over there. And can we, if we do move up here, obviously we're quite far away, but could we fit in around that we can? Okay. Yes. Yeah. Cool. So that is her done. It's my activation. Yep. As much as I want to be the big, <laughs> brave, heavy hitter that I am, it cost me a lot to get in that yeah, weak arc. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so I think I'm just going to move up one. Yep. Okay. Yeah. And then I'm going to end. Yeah. So I'm just going to move I, I up think, one yeah. and leave it there. Information is king. Yeah, I think the more time we have to see her pattern, yep. the, the, at least the easier time we'll have for a while. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So, so her next attack is going to be uppercut. Oh, she's chasing. Oh. She's going to move forwards three towards three. me. So she'll move forward once. Twice, then she'll move on there and push me. Oh, and where are you going to go? I so, shall go. One, two, three. Here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh my word, she's in your face already. So yeah. she won't turn on that last Oh, one. sorry, my bad. So she will be just be facing. Yeah, the arcs are very important, yep. 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 And then she's just going to hit me for five physical damage. Just, 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 five. Five. just five. She's got Ca a dodge value of two. Casual information five. for Jamie. Okay. Yeah. Well, she both is have weak been two so far. On the side that is towards us. This okay. Time. Good. On the right hand side. So if oh, I can grab. Yep. Four black dice. You go, so one, two, three, four. So five of this. Five damage okay. or none, as that roughly translates uh, to. None. none. Good yeah. work. Yeah. Good work. So that is her attack yep. done, um, and that is over to Jamie. All right. Okay, so Jamie. I'm not going to switch out any dodge. I'm going to keep myself at four this time. Okay. Because these attacks are at dodge two across the board so far. I need to be careful. Yeah. So I'm going to move a free one. Yeah. To there and spend two stamina to go and engage her. One and then into the weak spot. Yep. Uh, and then I am going to spend three stamina some dice, some to roll every dice on the table. So it's five <laughs> five black dice and one orange dice. Nice. And this is going to be at a total of minus four because she has two block okay. and you've got the minus two on the horn. Awesome. Oh. And at minus four, okay. we are looking at. Four damage. Four damage. That's pretty good. So yeah. she's from 34 down to 30. Not a bad first Nicely hit. Done, sir. First hit. Uh, it was half my health. Is that you done? Yeah. Yeah? Yep. So she will go. <laughs> What's she going to do? <gasps> Dodge one. <gasps> it's triple slash. So you know we saw double slash. <laughs> <laughs> this is what that would look like if it had okay. a three in that yeah, bubble. Sure. <laughs> So she's going to move forward one, not target her. It does push. So, so Jamie one. gets pushed off. So yep. Jamie gets to choose to where he wants uh, to I'll go. I'll have to go back towards the skull, yeah. So oh, that one there, yeah. yeah. Please. She will move forward one into the corner. She will turn to face the corner, oh, so the fantastic. direction of the arrow. And then she'll attack her front arc for five. So that hits no one. Okay. She would walk into the corner again. Yep, second time. Doesn't move anywhere. Turn around. And now she's going to hit oh, me no. for five damage. But I can take five damage like yep. a champ. This is going to be none again. Like a champ. <laughs> this is going to be none again. I take none. Oh, 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 oh. Too easy. Who made oh, this game? <laughs> <laughs> and then she's going to move forward once again. Uh oh. And then she's going oh. to wheel around. And then she's going to hit me and Jamie because oh. it's range one. So I'll just block it all first before Jamie dies. <laughs> sure. <laughs> So I take none. Yep. Um, and I then will. Jamie, I'm guessing, is going for a dodge. And you are Super dodge. four dodge now? Yes, please. And how many dodge do you need for this particular attack? One. Just the one. Just the one. Where would you like to move? Yeah. Oh, yeah, where do you want oh, to go to? Move. Uh, I'll move into base contact with her. Oh, yeah? Please, yeah. On this side? Please, please. Uh, now, her weakness is actually going to be gonna her be left. Opposite side, so Jamie can't I, I can't get, get into the weak spot, but I will but go into her right-hand side. A bit of free damage, assuming yeah. this is successful. Yes, yeah. Ah, well, I see your plan. And I so am he successful. is successful. Nice. And I will spend my heroic to immediately make an attack. Ah, good man. And it will be my heavy attack. So I'd like four black dice and an orange dice. And All these heroics. Yep. I get this minus four. Oh, uh, two, two free damage. Another two okay. damage. Did you pay for your dodge? No. Cheating. No, cheating. Give them, them right. Give them right. So, so down to 28 now. And she is weak on her right hand this side. side. Yeah. I'm worried about us getting all very close together, though. We're very much... Yeah. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. All It'll right. Be fine. 
I haven't taken any damage. I've been hit by every attack she's done apart I haven't from the taken first. any damage either. No. Okay. See, we're doing fine. Right. Nothing to worry about. Well, I'm going to then. So there's a note here. So I'm going to play this play one. Yep. And then it's part of, or just as my move, and then as part of my Balder side sword, I get a one move. Can I use that to then move into her? So I might advise, yeah. in the interest of being optimal, oh, yeah. oh. for three stamina, yeah. you get a move, okay. and it makes your attack range one. Yeah. So if you just go to here ah. with your attack, you can then run away after if, if you want to. Yeah. Ah, ha, ha, ha. So yeah, so there's the move. It's range one. We're going to spend three stamina, usually four, but we're getting that improvement from the upgrade. And, and I'm two. Get orange dice and obviously the black because you are in the weak arc. Oh, fantastic. Come on, knight. Oh, big roll. Okay. That's five damage. Yep, yeah, I'll take that. Nailed it. Down to Good 23. Work. Now, what is her heating up? 18. 18. 18. So we're already nearing that. Yeah. Um, I want to like buy an extra attack, but I can't, can I? Um, I will take the extra move. I do have the aggro, so I will simply move one away. This tank running away from combat. I well, I moved in. <laughs> beat down. You can't hang about after a beat so down. So now, Jamie, if this is a target attack, Jamie's going to be the target. Are you sure you want to move away? Jamie is closer. If I'm here... Jamie is still closer. So you, you have to, to move on to her. Oh, Jamie can dodge. <laughs> Jamie's got four dodge dice. I've got four dodge dice. Famous last words. I'm going to move away. Um, so here comes the next. Yeah. Let's do plunging. Attack. Ooh. Oh, so this is attack number four. Okay. Just to keep note yeah. of them, so we know we haven't seen that double slash that we yeah. saw from the grave. So that is the last card. This card. Yeah. So this is one, an icon we haven't seen yet. Okay. So I'll talk through how it works, sure. and then I'll let you show the uh, the audience what the card looks like. So it's a D-pad symbol, yeah. but it has an icon in the bottom left corner, mm -hmm. which means leap. Oh. It's leap on the target. Okay. The target is going to be Jamie because you ran away. Run away. Just... It's got a push with six damage. So she is basically going to leap up in the air, yeah. land straight back down on top of Jamie. <laughs> right. Jumping on top of me. And then the difference with um, a leap with a push, yeah. you can choose any adjacent node because okay. she's obviously in the air. Absolutely. You don't know what arc you're in. <laughs> sure. So she'll jump up and back yeah. down, but she'll maintain her facing. Yeah, okay. So she basically stays where she yeah. is. Jamie gets to choose where he would like to go, but as well, this lands on him, I'm assuming he's going to pay for a dodge. Cool. Yeah, okay, I'm going to try and dodge this. It's dodge two. Yeah. So I've got dodge dice of four. Oh, no. Do you have your reroll? You have one I reroll? do. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So let's see. So you need two Should successes. I believe. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nailed it. Yeah. Strategy. I, that's where would you away. like to move? Uh, just directly backwards, please. Thank Did you. Did you want to show the camera? Yeah, very quickly. That? Just so it's a nice, simple-looking one. Yeah. Um, so you see that in the bottom left yeah. with that little leap icon and then the six damage. No, the push. I don't want to go there. Oh, do you not? No, because I want to go. The double slash. I, do, I, just, I just worked out double slash's movement pattern. I'd like to go into the Double corner. slash goes the opposite direction to this. The turn is the opposite direction. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. turn is right. Yeah? It's going to the right. Ooh. Ooh. Good. And that's all coming down to the grave. The gravestone. Uh, the gravestone, finding that about and knowing that that's what's coming next. That's yeah. awesome. So yeah. that's that yeah. plunging attack done. Yeah. So it moves to me. Yep. Unfortunately, no weak point. No. Nope. So the big damage isn't going to be be as big as I would hope. Yeah, but the strategy we're seeing but we is also we yeah. don't we don't want to drop it past eighteen because Correct. I have moved with the knowledge no, that, that safe. you're safe. Yeah. So I could I could move in to her weak point okay. on that side. Does she have no a weak point? point? No. 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 Not the weak point. Uh, just her. No. Just, just pop into uh, here. Yeah, absolutely. Pop into this side. Tickle. Should I pay, or should I just, just should I pay the one? Pay the and one. Just do one. Give just a little try and do a little bit I of six so. damage. So I'll pay one. I'll be on one blue and one black. Blue so one black. even on a perfect roll here, she wouldn't heat up. Okay, good. So she's I've still got my plus one. So she's only got one armor against yep. me. So okay. I minus one. The highest I can roll on these is a five. Wow. So I can't heat her up. Uh, oh. So I subtract my one. And two, damage. Do two damage. Okay. So it takes it down to 21, 21 right? Yeah, that's right. Very nice. And that's me done. So, so her last card then? What could it be? Ah. <laughs> so she will push me off and I'll go onto the same node as Jamie. Okay. She will move forwards yeah. for one and then she will turn around that way, 90 yeah. degrees. She hits these two arcs here, yeah. doesn't hit anybody. Is it those two arcs? Yeah. No, it's these two arcs at the front. Yeah. So yep. it doesn't hit anyone because it's range yep. one. Would have hit me. Then moves forward again. Yep. Wheels around Absolutely. again. 
and then hits these two arcs again, so yep. it doesn't hit anyone. Good. She's weak in the back. Oh, that. I'm going after her. And you I'm going honest. after her. So you recover your two. Yep, cover my two stamina, start of my turn. Um, oh, did you just go? Oh, I'm jumping oh, no, in before Jamie. Jamie's me. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, Jamie. Jamie. It's all right. I was getting super excited to <laughs> unleash right. the pain. It's okay. Uh, I'm probably going to swap out. Actually, no. I'm going to free one, spend one, spend two, spend three. The rear? Yep. You got your Estus? Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm not an idiot. <laughs> 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 the, the silence was yeah. palpable at that moment. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> spend my Estus to recover all this, okay. and then spend three stamina to make my all the dice attack. All the dice attack. So you're going for the. Oh, and we're potentially going to send her into heat up. I need an orange for you as well. Yeah, it, it, it might send her into heat up mode, but it's, it's, cool. it's got to happen yep. at some point. Yeah. So this is minus four, correct? Yeah. <gasps> wow. Then there you see the most oh. assassin of assassin spikes. Six damage. Oh, my that's word. six damage. That's I mean, in terms of where we were, that's kind of pretty good. It's a decent yeah. drop below that heat yep. up number. So everything you used to know, forget it. <laughs> I never remember it again. I never remember anything ever again because we don't need to anymore. Because her ability is going to kick in now. Her yeah. ability is going to kick in. So it's still worth trying to remember them because you can yeah. when you get down to like the last you one, you can kind of play the probabilities. Yeah. So you want to remember what's in there and remember what's coming out. Sure. But it a lot of it comes down to the probability. Okay, yeah. So we'll let you oh, pick not one. This again. Go oh, for the middle one. Go for the middle one. I don't want to see it. I don't get to see it. Do you want me oh. to shuffle them? Yeah, please. I'm not willing. I'm terrified to know what that heat up ability is going to be. Yep. Okay. So she has heated up. Jamie, you done? Yes, uh, I've done everything I can do. So the aggro passes over yeah. to here, and she will go. Okay. And the first card is double slash. So the attack we just ah, saw, that's a good oh, one. Yeah, very good. So one so forward. Jamie, Jamie directly back. Oh, sorry, yeah, yeah. Straight back. Yeah, please. So she will move forwards one, wheel to the right, attack in front of her, and to okay. the right-hand side, not hit anyone. Okay. She will move forward again. She will rotate. She will attack in front of her and the right-hand side, which is no one again. Lovely. So we avoid that. She's weak in the bum. <laughs> <laughs> And you, it's over to you. And you do recover too this time. Yay. Because it's actually it's my turn. Right? <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going for the butt. Yeah. Yep. But. So if I do one for free. Yep. yep. So, and I then have a move of one and a, and a range of one, essentially. So if I move to her side arc, do, can I, does my range of one carry round? No. no. So you have to be standing in the arc. Uh -huh. But you could spend one stamina to move. Yeah. And then three to yeah, nip absolutely. around and use that. So yeah, I will spend one stamina to move to the side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then as part of my Baldur Sword ability, I will then spend three. And that will then let me have the move I need. Yeah. Yep. To come right round. In behind. Um, all this for an extra yeah. single dice. It's worth it though. Um, so two orange. Like for example, if you were to roll the two on that black, yeah. that means your actual attack dice are now straight dice. You yeah. just cancel the armor out with a free dice. Absolutely. And that's the strength of the weak point. Yeah. For the cost of one stamina, well yeah. worth it. Well worth it. Ooh, five five spaces on my endurance bar that was making you're me a little super nervous. super tanky, it's fine. You've still got your heroic. Oh. We haven't seen any magic damage out of her yet. <laughs> <laughs> It's oh, another good one's go. another five damage. Nice. Good for that. That's ten damage out of our tanky knight. Yeah. And can't really complain about that. Down to ten health. I don't want to get my hopes up. I'm not ready no, to, no. to have them dash yet. Is this going well? Um, okay, let's see it. Triple slash. Okay. So double slash immediately followed by triple slash. Okay. So she will push you off, and okay. obviously. And she doesn't reshuffle or anything at this point. No. Nope. No. The rule of the rule of the wall. Yep. Yeah. You can go whichever direction you no, like. She's going to go forward and then turn left. She's going to go forwards and then turn so I'll left. I'm going this way then. Yeah, yeah. Okay. The thing is, these, the order of these make no difference. Yeah. Because oof, we've not come across a heavy, a heavy attack yet. Yeah. So. But what we do know is we kind of know we haven't seen the plunge yet. Yeah. We haven't seen this yet. Absolutely. We haven't. So we know what we could see. Yep. Yeah. So okay. she will move forward one. Yeah. She will turn to the left. Yeah. She will attack in front of her. A range one. That's mm -hmm. nobody. Yep. Yeah. She will move forwards. She will turn left. Yep. She will hit me for five damage. Otherwise known as <laughs> nothing. <laughs> oh, Alex, stop it. One. Oh, oh, not one. Mural? Not one. 
we do I've got my luck. <laughs> Stop it, <dearie. laughs> And then she will. Be, that's her done. Yeah, just because it's just. Oh, right, right, so so I'm looking at the wrong card. So she's going to move in. Here. She'll move forward to there. And I'll jump pushed? behind her. Okay. Sneaky. And then I don't take any damage. I don't get Two hit turns. by that one. Yeah. And then in front. Oh, good. Lovely. So. So yeah, seeing the difference in the models and the bosses, even like the last video's mini boss, he was very much good at targeting one people and sort of breathing in front of them. Mm. The dancer's unpredictable, but also predictable to an extent. And the yeah. fact that she's not targeting one of us individually kind of breaks the tension. But then you've got that leap fear that at any moment it could just be like six. So, so you've kind of yeah. you've learned all the way through the game the importance of the aggro token, yeah. and then you're told to forget yeah. everything you learn. <laughs> yeah. You'll learn throughout the entire game that. Well, I need to learn these boss patterns because yeah. that makes everything easier. Well, you can ignore that now because you've nearly <laughs> killed her. Yeah. This is just like that fight where it's like, just forget everything yeah. you thought you knew. Which is yeah. good. So it's my activation. Yep. It's time for me to come in hot. Go I'm going to use my heroic. Be ten? Are you going for the full 10? No, I don't think you're going to match the full 10. I, I don't think it's possible. Okay, okay. But I can get close. Okay. But it's going to not cost me any stamina. I'm going to get this one back. Yeah, yeah, lovely. I'm going to use my heroic. Okay. Mm -hmm. The arc I want, I'm facing. Yep. So I'm just going to yep. free Lovely. into there. I'm going to get two of these. <laughs> and I love this. You can't, you can't see it, but Alex is in there. In behind oh, Max, the you can do his dancing. nine with so either could, weapon. So I'm going to grab another blue dice, please. Absolutely. So okay. I am on my two blue, my two black. I have my titanite shard still. Yep. So I'm reducing this by one. one. Yep. The best roll I can get is ten, so I cannot oh, one shot her. Okay. So reduce the one, she's down to five. five. Look at that, five, five, five. Fifteen of the three attacks is phenomenal. So Oh, Dancer, you're going down. I still have my Estus Flask and my Luck. Okay, so... So I'm not... Yeah, I'm good. You, you, yeah. I am parked. <laughs> I haven't moved, so I'm going to use my free one. Yep. I'm just going to use my free one. Okay. I think it's best if that I am taking these because yes, I'm sure. so healthy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you, you did you you moved in though. How did you move in? That was my heroic. Ah, that has a free move attached oh, to it. So good. So plunging attack. Oh. So she's gonna jump on my head. Boing. So glad that no no offense, meant Alex, but so glad that was on you. Yeah. And not one of us, because we both would have suffered quite badly from yeah. that. Yeah. Fortunately, oh, no weak points. points. So Jamie, I end up the, oh, the kill shot. The glory kill. The dual wielding knights getting the glory kill, Jamie. You can't fight for I don't know, I, I I think I can do it. So this is six damage coming in at me first. Okay. Otherwise, no, no, no damage. Yeah. Fingers crossed. <laughs> oh, Three okay. damage. Oh. Goes down to two because of my ember. Yeah, well remembered. Well remembered, yeah. <laughs> rim, yeah. Rim embered. Embered. No. Guys, Go, get out. anyone? <laughs> Get out. Oh, I'm sure someone. I'm sure you got someone. One, there must have been like one giggle. giggle. Comment. If you're the one that giggled, <laughs> comment. Um, no weak point on that though. So Jamie look, misses out on what he wanted. Jamie. But look, he's still going to be silly because that's what he I does. Lo I love you, okay? And I'm willing for you to go nuts. But just don't go nuts to the point that she'll then one shot you. So I'll pop my target shield for my soul arrow. <laughs> oh, she's got no weak point. She's got two. You've got five health, but I think five health is out of your reach with really? Soul Arrow. Soul Arrow and Murakumo. Why would you challenge him like that? So three black dice, on average, well, you're looking at dice. three damage. Yeah, I'm talking about Soul Arrow. Oh, okay, yeah. So your three black dice will, on average dice, get you three damage, which will go to one. Yeah. And then you've got... Is it four? It's plus zero on that one. Plus zero. So yeah, that works out on average. And then you've got four black dice, is it, on your other mm -hmm. one? So four black dice would average two damage. So you are averaging three damage, assuming you roll average, which is two less than yeah, we need. It's fine. I love the way Alex is trying to dissuade Jamie, but Jamie's eyes so, are so lighting up. So you're saying if saying... I roll better than average, I'll kill her. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what you're saying. I can see your eyes growing <laughs> wider. So you're making. So you mean this would be even better if I do it? <laughs> yeah. um, I will be sensible. He's going to relinquish. Oh, this is like, I just feel like I drew a legendary. I got sensible to him. It's like <laughs> the best upgrade you can get. <laughs> it's the rarest upgrade, upgrade you can get. <laughs> um, so free one, forwards. So you're going to go one to here. And spend two to get in. One, which, any preference on arc? Uh, no, really. I'm going to put you in this yeah, side. Yeah, so two to get in, and then three. See, the thing is, if I get clipped, I'm dead anyway. So I feel like I should take the soul arrow. 
No. No, because I have four dodge because dice. Because you have four dodge. Okay, uh, so there we go. That's Ooh. that. Uh, I need four black dice and an orange. Yep. Oh, I need three more in there, please. Three more in there. Got an orange. Orange is in already. So she's got two armor and you're losing two to the orange. So this is minus, minus four. four. Okay. But a big what. spike, she could die. So oh. minus the four, so two damage. Okay. So slap average. bang on average. So she's down to Can, can three I pseudo do the soul oh. error? No. <laughs> She's got three health left, and it's going to be, it's going to be the brave, I didn't, I didn't do it anyway. brave, <laughs> brave knight. Assuming we survive this, yep. the knight is going to get the, the a, kill on the I'm second boss nothing. of the night. I'm assuming yeah. nothing. It's the heat up. And I want to make this very clear, this was not rigged in any way, shape or form, that this is the point that this comes out. Jamie. Oh no. I'm it's a times three <laughs> plunging attack, so this is a leap times three on the aggro. So you have to dodge three times. He has and I have three. a dodge of one. Oh. I have three stamina left, so I can so do it. So if he makes all three of these, he will survive. But this is kind of this is about as bad as it could get Oof. in terms of who it. So you have four on. dice need one dodge. Four dice need one dodge. Four dice need one dodge. Yeah. So I'll be fine, everyone. He will leap up. He, Mathematicians out there, people that are way better at math than me, tell me what that is. <laughs> so it's like 93% she chance will... per roll. Okay. And then one of them has a re-roll, so even higher. So we'll leap up and yep. land. Jamie, where would you like to go? I'd probably over that way, I'm guessing, yeah, to start just... leading towards the knight. Yep. Oh, There's thank... no weak spots, is there, on this? Thanks, Offley. There right. are no weak spots so after this. Paid so she's... My... So she's first leaping dodge. to his so spot. So she's leaped and landed. Okay. First dodge. Just need one. Nailed Got it. it. No problem. Would you like to... Uh, what do I mean? You have moved. I have moved. Yeah. Second leap. Boing. Okay. Where would you I'll like to go? Uh, keep on going towards the night. So Second dodge. dodge. Oh, Got it. Got yes. It. Third dodge. And, this, and you're only able to dodge because you'd left four stamina yeah, available. Yeah. If you hadn't. If, if I'd have gone for the soul arrow, I would not be doing this. <laughs> Third one. Bonk. And I'm guessing you're going on to this one here. Yeah, anyone doesn't make too much of a difference right now. Oh, man. Okie dokie. I'm trying to reveal oh. the camera first. Oh, it's just the one! <laughs> that was horrible! God, Why would you do that? Around. I just saw so much green. I, I could like... look re-roll the success. <laughs> so Chicken. that was that was the heat up card, okay. which means this shuffles. So that gets resolved. Okay. It, ha it would keep the, the weak arc yep. of whatever it is. Because it hasn't got a weak arc, I'm going to shuffle it now. Right. Yep. But obviously, if you'd got a weak arc on there, you could save yep. the card and shuffle it gotcha. when she goes. Now, my Your advice activation. is kill it. Your activation. You have to kill it. That's some good advice. You have to kill Your it. Your activation. <laughs> you recover two stamina. Du -du -du -du. She has no weak spot. That's okay. It makes no difference. I got this. I just I think what I might do is just get rid of my shield. Yeah. Equip my morning star and do it with my morning star. Yeah. So you're gonna go dual wield knight again. Yeah. Yeah. Go for it. <laughs> gonna go dual wield knight. Uh, gonna, so she got three health. I'm gonna try the morning star first on. So you need to move in for the morning star. Oh man, yeah. So just straight up, just yep. right, right. Mano, mano. Have you got? A... Had, you can of yeah, you can afford both three yeah, stamina yeah, yeah. attacks. Irrelevant of the order you go. Which for. is which is what I'm gonna do. So, you need some dice. I need two blue for this one. So this is going to be minus two. Dice minus two. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh! oh! <laughs> and with a max roll of six, the morning star does it. <laughs> Boom! She's gone. The dancer e falls. MVP morning, morning star. star. <laughs> like, since you got that at the very middle of the other yeah. video we played, yeah. go on morning star cool. and dancers die. I've had dancers this time. weapon. Like, I, I only have... Two tier two stats. Yeah. I've had this weapon from SAT, but it's kind of when you're looking at your equipment and the way you go when you're gearing up. Yeah, you don't. You're not just focusing necessarily on. I always have to have the mm -hmm. best stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. you just need something that functions for, for each role. Yeah, my yeah. utility of regaining health and having kind of those extra resistance to get away from the magic huge, even more yeah. important than the damage dealing. Yeah. And those four dodge dice, like wow. the four dodge is so. If, if you feel so reliable. And like a superhero. Yeah. Well, look, I'm super excited. That was awesome. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please comment below. If you have any ideas on what else you'd like to see us play or any other bosses, again, please comment below. We'd love to know. Thanks, Alex and Jamie, for being here. And we'll see you guys in the next video. We hope you enjoyed this Let's Play. 
Go ahead and check out our other content on screen now and be sure to check out beastofwar.com for the latest gaming news and gaming let's plays. And while you're at it, why not hit subscribe and remember to ding our dong. Go on, you know you want to click it. Go on.